there in other places, but no, you cannot break it up into two easy payments of $19.98. So take advantage of that one day only price and place your order now if you've been in the market for an Amazon Fire TV stick. Your item number is E232852. If you're one of those like me who needs to learn a little bit more about this to decide why we need it, well, let me introduce you to Brett Hamilton. He is our resident tech wow. expert here. That's a fancy title. At QVC. You just say nerd. Sorry. Right. I was actually thinking about that. I was going to say, like, <laughs> tech expert. I didn't say nerd, but you said it for Geek. me. Geek. That's all right. Um, but we love the geeks. We love yep. the tech nerds because you make our lives easier by explaining to us how all this technology works. And the thing is, this price, I mean, what all you're going to tell us this does for this price yeah. with no... Um, Monthly fee. No subscriptions unless nope. you want to subscribe to a service. Right. But, but the device itself, what's nice about it is once you get it, you own it. You know, a, a DVR or a cable box, whatever it might be, in every single room can add up. It's 10 bucks here, it's 15 bucks there, it's $12 there. And then you say to yourself at the end of the day, what do I really watch on TV? Do I watch all 1,500 channels or 2,000 channels or whatever, right. you know, whatever my cable company gives me? For me, the answer is no. I can't speak for everybody, but I know a lot of you look at that right there and go, oh my God, that is a lot. There's a lot going on there. How is that going to make watching TV easier? And the answer is you don't really need to know anything about what's there. All you need to do is know what you want to watch. And by that, I mean using that remote. And at the very top of the remote, you can see a little tiny microphone. There it is. That microphone does all the work for you because it will search and find pretty much any TV show, any movie. It's even a gaming system. We'll get into all this over the next hour. But the cool part about it is once you plug this device in, and Terry said it perfectly, you watch anything you want, anytime you want, anywhere you want because it's portable. Portable is good because you can move it from TV to TV, but check this out. I'm going to throw you right into the fire because did you tell me this is your first electronics hour ever? It's my first electronics hour ever. Yep. I am not a techie by any means. And that's okay. But I thought, hey, let me take this advan take advantage of this opportunity yep. to learn for myself and to learn alongside you and hopefully ask you the questions sure. that you out, out there may have. And it's a one day only price. So, well, hey, yeah. listen, for 40 bucks, skip lunch or skip dinner going out yeah. or whatever, eat a tuna sandwich or peanut butter at home, buy this and see that it doesn't change the way that you watch TV. I do just want to tell, yep. show you this price real quick, how great it is in black and white and red. The retail price is $49.99. These are out there everywhere. But today at QVC, we're giving you a one day only price of $39.96. And even better than that, we are helping you break that payment up into $19.98 over two months with any major credit card. You don't have to be a member of any special club, any major credit card, even PayPal. And so, oh, and free shipping and handling, Woo. which, you know, we there always love we'll that. Right We've come to expect that and we love that. So let's jump in. Yep. What is a Fire Stick? Yeah, what is a Fire Stick and what is streaming? Because I think that's probably yes, the question. Yes, that's the question. Yeah, the people, okay, so pick that little stick up there. This looks like a lot like a thumb drive, right? A thumb drive that you would put in your computer. This is not for the computer. In fact, this will not plug into a computer. That is what's called an HDMI input. And an HDMI input is what's on the back of your TV. That's how your cable box is plugged in. That's how you plug in a gaming system. That's how you plug in a Blu-ray player. Whatever it is that you're plugging into your television now, the old red, the white, and the yellow cords from the VC CR days and the DVD players are gone. Right. So whether you know it or not, this will fit into the back of your TV if your TV was built in the last 15, 18 years. So we got that part out of the way. You know it's going to work on your television. Before we get into what is streaming, don't worry about the 4K part. If you don't have a 4K TV, this works. Great. If you do have a 4K TV, it works. If you don't have one, eventually you're going to get one because the next TV you buy will be 4K. So it's future proof meaning you don't have to buy a new one, which <laughs> is nice great. about electronics, right? Yeah. Usually you buy something, you know it's gonna expire in a month, a year, whatever it might be, and I gotta get the next one. Amazon's ahead of the game and made it compatible for all the TVs. Right. So all that said, what is streaming? Streaming allows you to find shows and movies and TV and all that stuff and watch it when you want through an internet connection. You're gonna need internet to use this, okay? You'll need that and we'll explain how to do all that in a second, but I want you to give me a movie or a TV show. Wait, Anything. real quick, so all you need to get this home mm -hmm. and start working is a TV that's at least 
you know, <laughs> like 15 within the years, last 15, within, it's probably right. closer to 20, but in the last 15 years. So that it has this HDMI input on the input. back, correct? And then internet. wireless internet. That's it. So those you need two those two things. things. Okay. And you're watching us right now on a television, so that part's definitely taken care of. And the whole Wi Fi thing, if you've got a computer or a tablet and you use that in your house, you have Wi Fi. So those two elements, and the reason you need Wi-Fi to answer your question and everybody else's question, there's nothing inside here other than the brain that makes it work. You know, your favorite TV shows and your movies and all that stuff don't live inside there, uh, there but they come from Wi-Fi and they come down into the TV. And that essentially, so you answer your own question, that is what streaming is. Wi-Fi enables you to watch your programming. So how do I find a show since there's over 500,000 different things to watch and, and enjoy and all that stuff? Use the remote. Give me a TV show or a movie. Sleepless in Seattle, which is so funny because this says sleepless, that's but sleepless? that's totally different than sleepless in Seattle. But sleepless in Seattle. <laughs> subconscious <laughs> kicking in. All right, so sleepless in Seattle. There it is. That's, and where is it coming from? It's coming from space. <laughs> <laughs> it's coming from a brain, the, uh, the Fire TV slash Alexa brain that Amazon has built goes and finds all of this content for you. And it's accessed through the internet. I mean, to pull the curtain back and, and show you how the magic trick is done, it would be the equivalent of you going inside the search engine and typing, 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 and looking for your favorite show. Right. Or you could just use this voice activated, uh, activated remote. And there's the microphone right there. That microphone will give you any show or TV, uh, uh, TV show or movie you want, but it also finds information, all that other good stuff. And we'll get to the whole Alexa thing and Echo and all that stuff in a minute. But essentially, you're getting an Amazon Echo which is Alexa, and a super cool way to watch your favorite shows and movies, all built in one for, I don't know, 39 bucks, whatever it is. So that's, that's what streaming is. Now, once you get there, you hit enter, and it will tell you, hey, it's either free, or it's through Netflix, or through Hulu, or through one of those streaming services. But I want to point so out- So in this case, how do you find oh, out? I'm sorry. That's okay. How do you find out- Sleepless in Seattle. If we can watch that. Well, yeah, you would you would go inside and click on the little icon, and it says watch, watch for, for free. free with Sony Crackle. And Sony Crackle is one of those apps that will come up free with. It, yeah, so you would just ask for that as well, and that's what's cool because again, to to Terry's situation and to a lot of you at home going, this is really this is a lot of information. This is all very new to me. What is Crackle and what is Hulu and what is Netflix? These are all just different, for lack of a better term, let's call these apps, right? You get your phone and you open up your phone and you're like tap, tap, tap onto those different apps. Think of these as apps on your television. Now you don't physically touch them, you just use the remote and you toggle down and you go to the right or to the left until you find something uh, that you want to see. Now Crackle is just another one of these apps. So if it says to you, you need Crackle, you just go Crackle. And there's Crackle. All right, how do I get that? Hit enter. Hey, over 100 people have already picked this up. So four o'clock in the morning. Good for you guys. You understand streaming. I'm still <laughs> learning though. No, hang in there. Hang in. Listen, what hang else in are you there. doing We've at 10 four in the morning? <laughs> he is, I, can, I can guarantee even if you've already picked it up, Brett will teach you something. <laughs> well, I learn every time I play around with this as well, that there's right. always something new. So we just uh, you just grabbed downloaded this app. Crackle. That's it. Now it's a free login. We're not, we don't have the time to do that. But if I logged in, built an account, it's just an email and you build a password, you could watch Sleepless in Seattle for free, which is by itself really, really cool. Because if you think about the fact that on cable right now at 4.10 in the morning, if you wanted to watch Sleepless in Seattle, the odds are pretty slim yeah. that you would find it, you know, or any other TV show for that matter, unless right. you recorded it. Well, how much is that DVR for all those extra rooms? I'm not saying cut the cable. But I'll tell you what, most people now are putting cable in one room, that central room where you right. all watch together. But how many of you, I'm speaking especially to QVC viewers, maybe your husband or your wife doesn't watch QVC, but you've got that extra TV that you got rid of cable on. You can bring it back to life with this and do <laughs> Husband this. wants to go watch The Sopranos <laughs> in the other room while you're watching QVC. <laughs> well, now you can without cable. Amazon and QVC got together and they built an app and this app is something else. Watch this. They built an app for Fire TV, which by the way, you don't need a cable subscription to make this happen or any of that good stuff. You just need Wi-Fi. This will allow you to be able to go inside and watch QVC. And I'm gonna show you more of this in a little bit, but you can now watch QVC, QVC2, and also you can watch Beauty IQ. 
Now, obviously you have QVC on your cable because you're watching us right now. Right. But a lot of you don't have QVC too. A lot of you don't have Beauty I have QVC IQ. too, but I have never been able to find Beauty IQ. I'm like, where does it live? Yeah, and, and, and you may not have access to it in your market because little by little it's landing in more and more homes and stuff like that. So I usually watch it online, streaming on my computer. Okay. But you're telling me now I can watch it here. And now you have the changes. app, but, but something else that's really cool you now have a web browser built inside here as well called Firefox. And Firefox will allow you to go inside here just like you would on your computer. You don't have to excuse me because my QWERTY mind doesn't work as, oh, it already knows what I want to watch. Next, QVC.com will now live on your television, which is pretty cool. <laughs> so now you've got a <laughs> full web browser just like you would, we can cruise on down here. Wow. And now you that. can shop on your TV, which is pretty wild, while you're watching QVC, whether you're watching it through the app, whether you're watching and it through. And see it a lot bigger. <laughs> Look at the detail in today's special value. Isn't that cool? Isn't that pretty? So a nice pretty screen, a nice big screen, but we have really just scratched the surface. And now you've got the ability again to be able to kind of pick what you want, and I call it building your own cable network. It's, it's Terry's cable company, it's Brett's cable company, whatever it might be. Because many of you go, well, I got all these channels in the main room, but I don't really watch them. I watch three or four channels. I watch QVC and I watch uh, channel B and C and D and all that stuff. Right. What if you, know, you went and got Hulu? I think Hulu was like, I don't know, 10 bucks a month and Netflix is 10 bucks a month. Hulu is mostly TV on demand. I don't have the rights to open these two up, so I can't, can't show you how, right. how in depth it is. But Hulu is a really great streaming service for television. Netflix is a really great streaming service for movies. movies yep. But many of you are Amazon Prime customers. And by the way, you don't need to be a Prime customer to do this. I'll let you in a little secret. Go up here to the top of your screen when you get your Fire TV and click over to your videos. You're already signed into Amazon to make this thing work and watch what it does. Anything that says Prime is free. So you say to yourself- Also, husband can watch The Sopranos in the other room. <laughs> he sure can. And to your point, Terry, now The Sopranos is on HBO or was on HBO when it was out. So you're like, well, I don't have HBO in my cable company. Guess what? Amazon went and paid for the rights to all the episodes of The Sopranos. So now this fire stick opens up programming that you may not even have access to on HBO anymore because I don't wow. even know if they're showing it on HBO anymore. So that's kind of scratching the surface of, of what this thing is capable of doing. Then on top of all that, people always go, well, I'm not a Prime customer, or I don't have Hulu, or I don't have Netflix. What can I get for free? Watch this. Amazon made a deal with this company, IMDB, that gives you all Your the information about movie movies. database. Exactly, which is super cool by itself yeah. online. But check this out. Every single TV show and movie and all that other stuff you see on here is free. They went wow. and paid for the rights to all of this stuff as well. And they're constantly adding new movies and taking movies away and adding TV shows and so that it's, it's fresh and it's new. And there's, there's always something in they here for somebody to watch. They want to be the big gun, so they're going to work hard they to do. get those deals with these yep. TV shows and... And all the rest of it that goes along with it, so... Okay, and so this one is free. This is free. And so a lot of the content is free, but this everything in here is free. Already just with what you get for free. Yep. Think about the value of this one day only price. For one payment of $39.96, no subscriptions to worry about, no boxes to rent, one payment of $39.96, you get this home and you're building your own network. The retail price is $49.99, but you're getting a break on that. That price does go away at the end of the day. It's an expiring offer. Because you're shopping at QVC, you are welcome to break that up into two monthly easy payments of $19.98. But even if at that $39, that's, I mean, a third of what you would spend for one month of cable, right? Not that we're saying to get rid of cable. I think this is like, you kind of need both, <laughs> in my opinion. But maybe you get rid of a couple boxes and what you're saving from one month of getting rid of those boxes uh, in the guest room that you don't use or yep. your kid's room who aren't really using it anyway. They're watching this kind of stuff. Uh, that's your savings right there. So, you know, basically you're making your money back in a month. Yeah, and, and you hit a really good point there in that when you buy something like this, you own it. And you don't have to pay monthly and weekly and have to worry about, am I using, am I not using, justify all that stuff. Right. Once you get this device home, there is no fee 
monthly to use the, the device itself. Again, services that go along with it, yes. If you pay for Netflix or you pay for Hulu or you pay for whatever it is that you're gonna use, that's a different story. But this one- Wait, real quick, you own, you I own. didn't wanna forget to ask yep. you this. If I go on vacation- Yes. And I stay at an Airbnb or even a hotel yep. room that has, can I bring that with me?